What's up guys, Shambles11, back with another Posty Present unboxing. Um, a, a kind of just a general retro uh, pickup this week. Um, as you can see, on its own, pretty rare I get a car only, and I never really put videos up of them, but I'm quite pleased with this one. Um, this is Total Carnage, um, as you can see on the good old SNES. Um, I do believe this is the spiritual successor to Smash TV. Super Smash TV, shall I say. Um, and I'm really quite pleased with this, because there were a few of these going. Um, they were kind of going up and up and up and up in price. Um, I actually somehow managed to get one. I put a £5 opening bid, and it stayed that way for, for five days. Um, so really pleased with that. Um, on to the actual unboxing itself. Um, I picked up this little beauty, Giant Mac Caveman Ninja. Now, um, this, was, this was a bit of a mm, annoying one. Um, I got this for £13 plus, I think it was £3.50 postage, so it's £16.50, which as you guys know, I have a £10 budget and this is well over, but um, I was quite happy with it because it was in good condition and it's Joe Mac. Um, I knew it didn't come with an inner tray, uh, but what has really annoyed me is the guy that posted it to me and put it straight into a jiffy bag, just straight in the back, just rammed it in, didn't think anything of it, and he got absolutely mullered beyond recognition. So, um, have a little look at the box to start off with. Um, so what I've actually done is I've taken um, a replacement inner tray from a uh, another game, just to kind of try and give it some shape and then I've had to pack the box either side to try and give it a bit of uh, rigidity back because this was mullered beyond recognition um, so inside you can see where the it was folded in half um, it's got torn um, it, it's, it just was not happy actually do you know what you can see it's got completely crushed um, leaving it alone for a few days has has actually um, helped it out a lot. Um, so yeah, so uh, not the original inner tray which I knew anyway, this is one I had in another game. Um, so there we go, Joe and Mac. This is a game that is pretty legendary. Um, very popular game. I played this but I, I never owned it, I borrowed it off a friend at school. Um, so this is actually the first time I played this properly on my own. Um, and I, I've been because it was all mullered. I have I have been through. As usually, I open things up for the first time with you guys, but um, I have had a little sneaky peek, and I love this manual. Um, it's kind of it it's done it, like it's a children's book or done by children. I don't know. It just seems really basic, but I I like it. Um, so many years ago, before the big freeze, covered our planets, deserts with ice. A caveman's life was not an easy one. Uh, missing girls and alone in the wilderness, and Joe and Mac, the only caveman available to rescue them. So we're we're rescuing missing girls. Bloody pain in the arse. So, uh, as always, uh, as I've said in previous ones, I don't understand why we have this, that, oh, the start button is the start button, select is the select. I mean, why does it tell us that? I don't know. Um, so there we go. Um, what I like as well is in these very basic drawings, we have little facts. Uh, there we go. Dinosaurs are a group of reptiles who lived on Earth for a total of 140 million years, from approximately 200 to 65 million years ago. Meat eaters were called carnivores, and plant eaters were called herbivores. The more you know, kids. Um, so yeah, so I'm very much looking forward to playing this. Um, a two-player game. Um, you guys will probably know I don't because I'm rubbish. What is a two-player super game? I like the sound of that. Maybe it will tell me. Um, how to play the game. Uh, Jam Mac. Caveman Ninja takes place within primitive realms of an era long ago, the treacherous regions which are abundant with hungry predators and scheming savages. Gang consists of nine major levels of play. The object of the game is to lead our courageous caveman Joe and Max safely through these perilous provinces in search of their humble homes' wavering, well, wandering even, women. Uh, there we go. Every kingdom has a mighty ruler. And to successfully clear a level, Joe and Matt will need to battle with each respective area's Lord of the Landscape. I mean, how amazing does that sound? Um, so there we go, the map. Uh, red dots are battle stages, blue dots are bonus stages, the white dot is your place marker. Pretty epic. There are several hidden stages that are not on the map. How cool is this? Um, there we go, you can read these facts yourself. The evil gate, that sounds pretty ominous. Um, key commands. So on our key commands, what have we got? Uh, pause. 
High jump, squat, dash, weapon exchange, somersaults. Well, that's pretty sweet. Uh, caveman collectibles. Sorry, my false teeth seem to be falling out tonight. Uh, one up, key, medium, uh, small, <laughs> medium and large. There we go. Prehistoric fact. Again, the wheel was not actually invented until 5,500 years ago. The first of which was made of wood. There you go. Amazing. Uh, no kids, it wasn't by me. Uh, club, bone, boomerang, fire, stone, wheel, prehistoric. In fact, this is brilliant. Enemies, baby, pterodons. Oh my god. Archaeopteridex. Uh, Zephyrosaurus, tyrant trophids, heterop bombs, and electric flying fish. As you do. Uh, can, oh, continuation mode. Little screenshots. Awesome stuff. So, very much looking forward to playing this. Um, today I am recording this on a Sunday. Tomorrow is Monday. So, that means it's a Shambles Let's Play, uh, or Shambles Plays, should I say. Um, and I think we're going to have to make it a little go on this. So, I'm going to um, very carefully restore this all back up and put it back in its little storage world to try and uh, save it a little bit more. Um, also, uh, I'm going to have to grab Mini Shambles 11 again and, and have a go on Total Carnage because I've never played this one either. So, um, not complete in box entirely because we're missing the inner train, it's very uh, delicate. But these are games <laughs> 62 and 63. So, crikey, the collection really is getting there. Fantastic stuff. Um, thank you ever so much for watching. As always, leave me a comment. Um, check me out on Twitter at uh, Shams11. Uh, come and shout at me if you want to see some games being played. Um, that's where I will give you all my information and let you know when videos are up, etc. etc. Et thank you ever so much for watching. Till next time.